What's up YouTube and welcome to another video by the Unlucky Lads. This will detail the raid intel skips on both critical and regular for the raid starting on the 26th of October running through to the 1st of November which is Project Titan Week 101. Please remember to enter our competition which you can do by sharing or posting about the Unlucky Lads and sending a screenshot of it to us via Instagram, Facebook, Twitter or Reddit. Please note that the competition will close on the 28th of October at 23.59 and a winner will be announced later that week. And if you haven't already, please also subscribe because your support motivates us to make these early raid intel videos, which allows you to quickly complete the raid as soon as it's released. Starting with critical, the modifiers this week will be One Gun, Injuries Bleed and Technique Slowdown. And using the intel skips, you can begin by collecting one intel from the Cold War site, which is northwest of Gollum Island. After you have that, you can input the password into the node at Heliport to grant access to Bow at the chemical refinery. Once you've beaten him, you can head into Sector 2. Gargoyle requires three intels at Camp Salamander before interrogating the two redheads, one at Camp Phoenix and the other down at Missile Site Ruins. Once you've interrogated both guys, you'll need to input the password into the node at Testing Zone, where you can also defeat the Flying Titan. For Supercomputer, there is no intel required this week, so you can just go straight to the Quantum Boss Battle at the Building in the Sea. Once you've beaten Gargoyle and Supercomputer, you can head into Sector 3. Here you'll also notice that Cerberus is a free boss as well this week, meaning you don't need any intel and can go straight up to the Lava Shield, and winning that fight will complete the critical raid. In summary... The modifiers are the hardest part of this week's raid, and even they aren't too bad, although one gun can cause some bother at times. However, it's hard not to be excited about the intel, because there are not one, but two free bosses this week, which is probably the easiest raid there is ever going to be. So you should be able to speed through it and earn those rewards. That said, if you do run into any issues, please let us know by commenting below, and we'll try to help you out so you can finish the raid. Moving on to regular, there are no modifiers, and it does just use last week's critical intel. So first up you'll need to destroy the three panels at Chemical Refinery, and then you can fight Bao there too. After you win that battle, you can head into Sector 2. Gargoyle requires you to destroy three panels at Forgotten Sanctuary, giving you access to the boss fight at Testing Zone. And Supercomputer requires you to press four nodes simultaneously, two at Camp Phoenix and two at Salamander which will open up Quantum at the building in the sea. And once you've beaten both Titans in Sector 2, you can progress into Sector 3. For Cerberus, you'll have to get two intels at Prototype Workshop before you can head up to Lava Shield to interrogate one guy up there and also grab an intel too. After that, you'll need to press four nodes at Scandium Mine before finally putting a password into the node at Red Phoenix. Doing all of that will open up the final Titan boss battle at the top of Lava Shield, where you can complete the regular raid. That's all for now. Don't forget to enter our competition before the 28th of October at 23.59. Just DM us a screenshot showing your social media support. And also, I hope you've enjoyed this video enough to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Just click on the logo in this video or down below because your support really does motivate us to make new content. But until next time, peace out, the unlucky lads.